Hello everybody, how's it going? My name is Inkais, welcome to my channel, and welcome back to Inkais Plays this War of Mine, the little one's expansion on top of the latest release of the Anniversary Edition DLC, with the new campaign elements, and a brand new ending. Um, if I... If you weren't captivated by the first episode, I hope that in this episode I can really, uh, you know, capture your attention and show the uh, gravity and the gravitas of this game and the situation and the, the sorrow and the darkness that will soon engulf our entire shelter and our poor little survivors. Uh, this is day three. Um, the only bad thing about our YouTube series is going to be that when we reset the game, the days are going to be reset, so there's a chance that next time when we load the game, if we end this episode by coming back home at the end of the second night and seeing that this night was calm, if we restart the game for the next episode and we re-enter the house, that's going to be re-roll. So that, it, you know... The end of one episode doesn't mean that the beginning of the next episode is going to be exactly the same. It We might re-roll into somebody like getting extremely sick or us getting robbed or things like that. And what I do know for sure right now is that uh, I'm pretty sure my guys are hungry. Their bios are updated. What's going on, Pav? They too. I hope those LD people have some family to support them. We shouldn't steal from them anymore. I, I, hey, man, I didn't take sick wife's medicine okay I'm a good person ish I don't care where and how Marco got supplies I'm glad he didn't return empty-handed Bruno is a little more selfish but he has a good heart okay people people are different not everybody is the same and Bruno just he, he, he cares about survival a little more than anything else you know personally I'm not proud of it but I had to steer from those uh, poor people. We are in dire need of supplies. It's true, Marco. It's true. Can't argue with facts. People are hungry. People are tired. Um, Pav, you don't you don't need to sleep anymore. I think, Bruno, you go sleep. And Marco, can you go please check the? You're gonna be the second person sleeping. Can you go check the bench? Because I want to make some... We have two water filters. That's not bad at all. We do have components and wood that we could make fuel out of, but that's not entirely necessary. Would you... Uh, can you just sit down? And then can you go and uh, give me, get us some water? How much water do we have? 13? How much water do we use for cooking? Hold on, before you do that, don't do yet. Don't, don't go yet. Uh, can you check cooking? I know that Bruno would use less water for cooking. But I just want to get like a general idea. It's going to take five. Ugh. Oh, we don't even have vegetables for... Extra meals. Oh, that, that's gonna that's gonna be rough. All right. Uh, yeah. Make some more water. My mouse is acting super weird. I don't know why. This mouse is just so old and weird. Um. Yeah, sounds good. Somewhere to be clean water. You'll need it to prepare a good meal or make alcohol. We're gonna use one filter uh, to get four water in. Half an hour plus five? What do you mean? Oh, it takes half an hour to set it, and it takes five hours for it to collect the water for us. Fair enough. Hopefully, we can upgrade the stove and the workshop and things like that. What's up on the radio? You can check the radio real quick. Day three, you're listening to Radio Pogoran. We regret to announce that our colleague jo Jovan died this morning. He was shot by a sniper on his way to work. He will be missed. That's messed up. Still gonna be nice. We don't have to worry about the cold too much yet. 
yet is the key word. We might listen to some classical music later. I haven't decided. Despite desperate, despite desperate counterattacks by the rebels trying to lift, yeah, this is the old news. The good thing is like the new, new news gets updated here and gets added there. Uh, we're gonna go back to the game music because I, I love the game music. I've said that before. I'll say it again. God damn it. There's no way you can get to this, right? There's absolutely zero places to reach. Right. Oh, crap. Oh, cool. It's a traitor. All right, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, 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 go. Go. Um, we have... How much wood do we have? Eight? We need parts, components, wood, and electric parts. And vegetables. Vegetables... Vegetables. Vegetables and medicine bandages. Electric. Oh, we need so many things. Wait, what the update on the situation? Only one chair. We have one bed, but we could use more. It's hard to get a good night's sleep on hard concrete floors. We have a radio. We like listening to it. We're reading this books. A good book. We've got to find books. Uh, cigarettes consumed every day. Three? You're smoking three cigarettes a day? I only have three left for you, man. Slow down. <sighs> okay. All right. All right. We got this. We got. We got this. We got this. We got, open the door. What do you have? What, what you got? What do I want? I want bandages. Oh, I gotta show you a lot in exchange for that. What about these awful cigarettes? You can I can have them for almost nothing. Yeah, let me let me take these first. Um, wood components, and that's basically all you have. And fuel. Okay, fuel, fuel. Let's take some fuel. I can stack four. All right. How do you feel about these fuel? How do you feel about the wood, almost for nothing, almost for nothing. All right, what can I give you? I can give you um, broken toy. Nothing special, but not bad either. You gotta be kidding me! Show me some more. What about two broken toys? Three broken toys? You don't want you don't want three broken toys. I understand that. One piece of beautiful jewelry here, sir. You, that's not enough. What about plus three toys? Damn. Okay. Um. Canned food. It won't do. Canned food, jewelry, and a broken toy. Two broken toys. Three broken toys. No, I'm not going to give you all my broken toys. Sorry. <laughs> Get good. Herbs, we're gonna keep the herbs. Meds? Do I want to give my meds away? That's insanity. Don't, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Don't be crazy. Let's just, let's, you know, let's negotiate, Franco. How about I take one less fuel, one less wood, one less component. Fewer, I should say. And also that you can go. No, you're not happy? Alright, take that. Take one more of those. One more of them. You know, no. He's not budging. He doesn't he doesn't care. He's like, nope, still not good enough. Alright, give me the wood back. Give me the fuel back. Okay, I have another deal for you. How about I give you fertilizer? One fertilizer. Two fertilizers, three fertilizers. Dude, you're driving your hard bargain, man. This is nothing. I can find this garbage anywhere. You're taking so much from me. Deal. Goodbye. Thank you.
See you later. Alligator. Shh. Don't... Don't talk about that. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Just ignore... Wounds. Go back to the workbench. I'm surprised he didn't have, like, any... Lockpicks or anything like that, because lockpicks would have helped me a lot in my house, my own home, metal workshop. We're gonna make it. Well, do I want to make the metal workshop? It allows us to make tools such as shovels for cleaning rubble, crow rubble, crowbars for breaking doors, and knives for self defense. Later, we can make advanced tools or even repair firearms. Um, but if I upgraded it, that I can. And enables the manufacture of more sophisticated items and appliances, providing us with more options to get food or meds and trade goods. We can upgrade it further uh, to make electrical improvements. Um, make the metal workshop. This floor is going to be for the workshops. Yeah, you sit down. Marco needs to rest. Okay, you're you're done. Get up. Get up. You're not tired, you're just slightly wounded. Just relax. Okay, buddy. Gotta gotta get you to the bed. You do understand that's one of your last three cigarettes? Oh, never mind. I did pick up better cigarettes for you. Yep. Yep. Okay. You better not go up in your cigarette consumption, because I'll be pissed. Okay, you don't work. Just sit down. Alright, you done with that? Alright, get down here. Run? Lockpicks. Sweet. Okay. We just need components for the lockpicks. Cool. Alright, components and parts. Sounds fair. We can do that. For the knife... We need weapon parts and components, crowbar, shovel, how about a shovel? Yeah, so when we go out tonight, we're going to have to prioritize components, as you can see. And components, parts. A heater is going to be important to make, so more components. Just, just load up on components, buddy. Yeah, components, components. Malkovich, 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 Malkovich. Components. Get all the components. And Bruno, why don't you go check out what, what it takes to upgrade a stove again? Is it components? Components, 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 and wood. Lots of components. Okay. You guys are hungry, but not starving yet. We're gonna wait until you're literally starving. Um. I wonder if you can actually put any furniture in here, too. Where are the breaches? There's a breach here, there's a breach here and here. The basement looks fine. You bored? Don't be bored. We're waiting for, um, what's his name? Marco to get up. Can you close this door? You need some privacy. Thank you. Much appreciated. How much for another chair? I think we can make another chair right now. Nope. Components. Okay, you go stand next to him. Maybe you can have a conversation. Eventually, they'll talk to each other. Just not talking to each other right now. I don't know why. They're not comfortable. It, it is getting colder. It used to be 62. And now it's 60. So that's not good. And something I need to look into 
and maybe if you guys are familiar with it, maybe you guys can help me uh, in the comments, is if somebody's in the bed and I end the day, do they instantaneously like recover the tiredness? Like do I do I have to wait for the for the status to go away or if I end the day it'll count as them having been in the bed the entire time? You rested right on time, man, and day. Okay, semi-detached house. Half of it is in uh, ruin. Uh, shots were heard. There's danger here. I'm not ready for danger. We cannot face danger. So many places are dangerous right now. Danger, 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 Malkovich, 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 Malkovich components, components, components. No, we need components, which I think will be materials. Parts? The looted gas station might be a... Do we finish the looted gas station? I think it was a basement with jewelry and a note. Um, let's go to the church. Sure. Sure. Pavel? You're slightly wounded? Sleep in bed. Guard the house. And let's go scavenge. At St. Mary's Church. It said... Uh, he might have something to give away or trade. Um, okay, let's prep. Give away or trade. We'll take one med, one canned food. Uh... Toys might be nice to have. A food, toy, maybe even this jewelry. The rest of the inventory is gonna have to be components. Components, 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 components. Let's go. <coughs> this place could be dangerous. I don't trust it too much. We're gonna be very cautious, as the game also advised us. Caution advised. We'll take some wood. And by some, I mean at least, like, ten, maybe? Okay, he's still alive. He hasn't been shot yet. Oh, I gotta sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. More. More. That's what I came here for. Came here for components. Welcome! We have been robbed recently, so we have little left. Did I... Did the robber look... Anything like me? My flock sleeps beneath the church. Please do not disturb them. Jesus. They don't need to be disturbed. This guy's already disturbed. His legs have gone numb. So shall we trade? Yes, sir. What you got? Well, like, you look much younger than your in-game sprite. Sprite? No. Whatever. Books. Because is uplifting, the more we have, the better. Yeah, because we don't want to we don't want people to get depressed. That's another issue. How many books can I take per stack? Two? I can't. I don't have room. Am I just gonna take books? Okay, I like that. I like that. Would you care to give me the bandages? Oh wait, cigarettes too. You can have almost nothing. Alright, how many per stack? Fantastic. Would you like canned food? And a piece of jewelry? It's very generous of me. Well, what if I took this one too? Then I've got to be kidding you. You see, this is... <laughs> Okay, um, take that off. I don't want to be too generous, buddy. What 
What if I give you your own wood? I'm gonna try harder. Jeez, dude, you drive a hard bargain. Are you happy with this? And we have a deal. Two books and 15 cigarettes for jewelry and wood and all that. I deal. Deal. Fine. 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 You too, sir. I'll be around. Sit down. Relax. Relax! Relax! Man! Calm down. Sit. Just sit. Just go take some more of your wood. Just sit down. Just, just don't pay attention to me. Just tie your shoelaces. Yeah, you too. You sit down too. Everybody sit down. Yeah, you do know how to get down there. There's a ladder here. Those days are over. I need wood. Nothing here. Is he gonna be mad if I'm down here? He did say don't go down here and don't disturb them. But... He didn't seem upset. Hey! Don't sneak up on me like that, pal. Sorry, buddy. Would you like to go outside? Oh, he's telling me to leave. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh, what? Are you... Serious? I gave your church your own wood? <laughs> Call me a vermin? You know what? I think maybe we're done. I'm happy with this. Let's go. Unbelievable people! Just absolutely mean, rude, impolite. Okay, let's see who died since last night. Rough night. We've been raided. Damn it! Someone came at night to take our things by force. Someone tried to rob us. They must have been more scared than us, so they didn't do much harm. Too bad we had no weapons. Brun and Pavl were wounded, and the attackers took a few things. We should put more people on guard. So they stole a load of food and cigarettes. Pavl has a deep wound he could do with some bandages. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! You can't die on me, man! Pavl. Alright, let's let's see. Let's see what happened. My story. All the shelling, sniper fire, and lack of supplies makes you want to hide away, sit down and cry. We cannot let them crush our spirit. We have to show them that they can't take away our dignity. It's difficult here. But you know how we did it? On our street? Are there any animals left in the city? I'm so hungry I'd even eat a rat or a pigeon. No, don't worry about that. We're gonna cook some food right now. Okay, Marco's sad, very hungry, and tired. You need to go cook. You need to wake up. I'm sorry, but the bed is Marco's now. Oh, he's so wounded. Marco, run to the bed as fast as you possibly can. We're gonna make... Very hungry, very hungry, very hungry. We're gonna make three meals. No, no, not you, not you, not you. Bruno the cook. The chef, I should say. Actually. 
you make that. And then I'd like you to go catch some water for me. If you can sprint, that would be wonderful. Bruno, you can have your meal. Go get the door. Oh, you know what? Wait, 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 wait. Bruno. You go, you go talk to this guy. Don't get the door. Go make some water filters for me. What do you want? What? What? Save people from a collapsed building. Thank goodness you're here. A shell hit a tenement down the street and people are buried underneath the rubble. Please help me put them out or pull them out. Every pair of hands is needed. We will organize a makeshift hospital for the wounded at my home. I have some beds and medical supplies. Will you help? Give me a sec. What's the temperature at? 60? Before I do that, can you get over here? Can you eat that? Go, go you, Bruno, go do, go do it. Go do it. Go do it. Go make him proud, yes. Good karma. We just uh, had to go help our neighbors. They would probably do the same for us. I hope. If a shell hit our shelter, we could be in a similar situation to those people. They could count on us. I hope we can count on them. I. Uh, you guys are very optimistic. I hope that's going to be the case. I need bandages, though. Alright, we're gonna make a couple of lockpicks. Make that three. Please don't sleep for the entire day. I'm, I'm, I beg of you. It'd be nice if you woke up relatively early. Pavel needs to go. There we go. Good. Go eat the food. Go eat your meal. Courtesy of Chef Bruno. And then please take a look at the upgrade situation here. Damn it! We're just short. We need to bring more components in. Okay. Fair enough. Go ahead and lockpick that. Go ahead and check the radio. I need to see what the news is today. Situation in the city of Pogoren. School outside with clouds and possibly rainfall. Our advice for cold evenings is grab a good book and a hot cup of tea and relax in your armchair by the fireplace. You guys are giving people false hope here. Mass graves were discovered in the town of Gravio. No pun intended. The military has secured the area and denies reporters access until the end of the investigation. Okay. Uh, you go... Open that. I need to see what's beyond that. Or inside of that. It could be really useful. It could be another lockpick. In fact... Hungry and wounded. Alright. So we're gonna need veggies. 
We're gonna need food, water, components. Oh, nice. I told you there's a lockpick in it. And we need bandages. Bandages, very, 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 very important. Alright, go get that one. We only have a couple of things left behind locked doors. Bruno's not going to be back today. I don't know when he's going to be back, actually. He might not even come back tomorrow. Which means... Pavl... Being wounded... He probably needs to go out and... Scavenge for us? Maybe even go back to the church? Get bandages for himself? I'm not sure. The situation is not... That great. The, the raid on the house was definitely a huge setback. Another lockpick. Two books. Good. What's our situation like? Our things... Uh, one bed. We could use more. Da, da, da. We have a few books. A good book helps forget the horrors of war. We have breaches in the walls. Our shelter is not safe. Alright. Cigarette consumption is down to zero because Bruno is away and he didn't even take any cigarettes with him. That's, that's cool with me. I don't mind. This has already been checked. Right. So the only thing left... ...is this. But I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to finish... ...the pile of rubble and get to the door. We only have one hour left. Maybe we'll, we'll get the chance. The thing is, I'm definitely not gonna have a wounded person stay at the house and try to guard anything because that's just insanity okay can you make it here can you lock pick that and open it yeah we couldn't we couldn't all right you're gonna be guard you're gonna scavenge and we are gonna go back Lots of meds. Huge amounts of materials, some meds. Uh, huge amounts of weapons. There are a lot of goods and they're willing to trade, especially for alcohol or cigarettes. But be careful. You never know what to expect from them. Lots of meds and foods. Huge amounts of weapons. Possible trade in danger. We're going there. We're, we're going there. We're going to take all the cigarettes. Every one. I don't have alcohol, but I got cigarettes. And I have pills. You know what? I, I won't need more than two pill bottles. Let's go scavenge. Hello. <laughs> How's it going? I have stuff to trade. I promise. I limp, but I have good things to trade. Don't mind me limp. I limp very nice. A 
This place is huge. This place is huge! There's a basement too. Okay, sorry, 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 I didn't mean to... I was just scrolling. I was just scrolling. I was just scrolling and I misclicked. I am so sorry. Hello. Trading. You have a straight up an assault rifle? Bandages. I need bandages. Water. Give me a full stack of water. At least. You also have a shotgun. And you have shotgun shells. And you have a... Oh, you have a pistol too. Dude. You guys are... Stacked. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna see you. Nothing special, but not bad either. That's good. That's good. What about this one? Exactly what I need. I can give you a lot for this. Okay. Good to know. Let's try the cigarettes first. <laughs> it's not gonna work out. Um, wh what about just taking one bandage? What about if I wanted to just do this trade? If I gave you good cigarettes and some garbage cigarettes. Okay, you need meds. How many of the cigarettes can I take away before you're upset? It won't do. What if I put all the cigarettes on the stack and took some weapon parts from you? I need three, man. I need three. I need three for a knife. Acceptable deal. Sayonara. Oh. I'm gonna find out that Bruno's dead. Or something, he got stuck on- Oh, Bruno's back! Yes! Bruno's back, at least. At the end of today's episode, we don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow, or, I mean, a couple of days when we come back to the game. We're gonna return after helping out some people buried under that collapsed apartment building. Cool. Alright. Nice. I'm happy about that. And we're gonna call it an episode here. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave the, a like on the episode. A thumbs up would be greatly appreciated. And as always, thank you so much for your time and attention. I'll see you guys in the next episode of this war of mine. Goodbye.